Hi, my name is Simone Fraser. I am an artist and a gardener, and I just returned from about four weeks in Busan, Korea, working with Mary Ellen on number 18. Um, I was focusing on the Gaia soil production and garden design part. And so I had a good amount of time to ruminate on the question, what is Korean? The things that stand out most to me about Koreans is their resourcefulness. Um, Koreans don't waste anything. They're really good at recycling, at, you know, dealing with just society's trash in a really efficient and well-managed way. And the city itself was incredibly clean as a result of this sort of like extremely hygienic and resourceful mentality. It's incredibly clean. The subways are immaculate. The sidewalks are immaculate. You don't, it's nothing like New York. You don't see piles of giant garbage bags. <laughs> just, you know, block after block. Um, you can't even buy garbage bags in Korea. You can spend about five dollars on one large plastic bag and that's like the closest you'll get to a, a contractor bag, which are ubiquitous here. Um, so for that reason, the Gaia Soil Project was really appealing to Koreans when we workshopped it. People were really enthusiastic. It seems like have a practice set in place that keeps things keeps things running smoothly like here the downside of that is that korean culture and pop music is like just popular culture is really boring and really like vanilla butterflies and like cape you know it's just there's no subversion there's no there's nothing really, in, like, really, you know, there's great stuff going on, but, like, in terms of art and in terms of cult, in terms of, like, pop culture, it's very, um, conform, conform. They really believe in respecting older people, and, you know, so if somebody's just one year older than you, you address them in a completely different, like, tense or form, form, you address them in the formal. Um, which we don't really have. Uh, old people are treated with extreme respect and they sort of really own that. They have a very entitled attitude, the older people. It's like they demand respect. If you don't give it to them, they'll take it, you know? <laughs> they're, very, they're very friendly. They're very welcoming. Yeah, I mean, but that's also part of the culture. It's like you walk into a store you walk into any sort of establishment and you have to look at everyone in the room and acknowledge them and do the formal greeting. So it, friendliness is sort of part of the whole respect and you know, social structure that's adhered to.